it's all important down in Frost Park. It's a large park. Um, we have a lot of youth sports in this city that should be using it. Um, but mainly for me, I run a youth football program with cheerleaders. Um, you know, there's no other big park in the city, rectangular, that our team can use. Um, so we need a big area. I have, you know, five football teams and five cheerleading squads. Uh, you know, my kids haven't had a goalpost to practice kicks in, in, in 10 years. So we need a field. We, we need goalposts. We need lines that the kids can learn to line up with. Um, that same field can be used by so with soccer. It could be used for lacrosse, rugby. You know, there's a lot of youth sports in this city that could use that one field. All good comments. They covered sports, the environment, safety issues, um, things that would make the residents comfortable being in the park, um, basically being proud of that area. Yeah, I think that I think it was an excellent meeting. I think everything was pretty much covered, especially the environment. At DCR has been pretty adamant about the fact that this is all we're getting from them. Uh, so I, they have never said that they're going to take care of anything besides the field, and we are very grateful for having that field. But this getting finally getting attention at Foss Park has brought up all the other issues, and we're not getting answers on that. So the city's taken it upon themselves to provide those answers. But again, if we're going to be spending possibly millions of dollars on a piece of state property, I don't want to have us spend uh, $10 million for trees or something, and then the trees die and we need DCR to take care of it. So everything, everything we put in financially, we need to be able to have control over.